Hi friends and welcome to Work of Art Wednesday with Miss Anita. Today we are going to be making something super cool, super fun, super easy, okay? It is called ice paint. Ice paint is water, paint, and an ice cube tray. It is those three simple materials that you will need in order to create the perfect ice paint. Now I have some water right over here. I have a bunch of different paints. So I have purple, I have red that I'll be using. I have blue, yellow, black, and green. So I'll be using six different colors. You can use as many as you want, depending on how many ice cube trays you have. I do recommend friends that you use washable paint. Washable paint will make it so much easier to clean up if you end up making a mess. All right, so go ahead and grab those materials and meet me right back here. Okay, friends, so if you have all your materials now, what I'm going to do is show you all the steps that you will need to do in order to make your ice paint. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, so first you're gonna set up your ice cube tray and you're going to begin by filling the tray roughly about one third of the way with paint, okay? You can use whatever colors you would like, okay? So I'm starting off with purple and I'm going to add a second purple right there. So one third of the way, I think that's one third of the way. Okay, now parents, you can help your child with this. Just tell them when to stop and when to go. Now with your warm water, you just fill the colors to the top. Hopefully nothing leaks. We have our finished product and we have to bring it to the freezer and it has to freeze for about three to four hours, okay? So let's bring it into our freezer now. No opening and closing the freezer to check. Let it sit. Be patient, friends. Okay, friends, we are back and it's been about three to four hours since I put the paint cubes in the freezer. So let's check them out. I think they are ready to use. So now I'm gonna go and grab some paper. So I have my sheet of paper and I am going to paint whatever I want. So I decided I would like to do a rainbow. Friends, you can do anything you'd like. You can paint a truck, you can make flowers, you can do a lot of things, but I'm going to start with a rainbow. I'm going to first use the color red it is so cold so i'm just gonna drag it along my paper just like this so i use red now i'm going to use purple they are slowly melting friends but they give off a really nice color so you just drag it along just like the red until oh, until you get to where you want it to be oh is dripping you see how it drips but that's okay next I'm going to use yellow wow this yellow came out very vibrant you have to use them quick though friends right because they're going to melt that's why I said it's better to use it outside if you can so that way if it gets messy it's messy outside and not inside right so now I have yellow. I'm going to use blue next. Oh, wow, this is amazing. I'm so happy with the way that these ice cubes came out. Right? Look how cool. It's as if I was really painting with a paintbrush and paint. 
Um, let's see what's next. I'm going to use green next. Green. And then I have black after this, and I will be done. In black. Very cold on the fingers, friends. Very cold, but it will be perfect for a nice spring or summer day. And there you have it, friends. My finished masterpiece using the ice paint. I think it came out pretty nice. I did not expect it to be this bright, which I'm super excited for. Now, I cannot wait to see what you come up with, okay? Please email us so that we can see what you have made, okay? Bye. Hope you enjoyed this video.